Hello friends and welcome to another Duke Family Adventure here at Epcot. We, uh, as we're talking, as we came in, we have done just about all that are least open. We have done all of the character dining experiences here at Disney, except for a couple uh, that are still remaining shut uh, due to the pandemic. But we've never done this one. Akershus here at Epcot. The princess experience, I'll just say that. So we're excited, we're gonna head over there. We're gonna take a look at, uh, we're gonna eat what they have. I don't really know uh, all that they have there. I guess it's a family style, but anyway, come along, join with us. Akershus here at Epcot. And of course, don't forget, over to your journey, journey to imagination. You can always see Winnie out there. All right, and that's where we're headed, journey into imagination with Figament. It's been a while since we've done Figment. Hello, on your tour, you'll see how the five human senses can help capture your imagination. All together, if you would please read line three. <laughs> Welcome to Imagination Lab. Some pretty cool character experiences I think they've gotten back to in here. They always love the Melody Maker. So I think we're a little too late, but over there, Vanellope and wreck it Ralph are there. And then back over, and here. over here, one of our favorite Inside Out, Joy and Sadness are often character experiences. So. All right, so here we are in Norway. Akershus, the Prince Story, Princess Story Book Dining. So it's right outside uh, Frozen. And there we go. And there's Frozen down there. And here's the menu at the uh, Princess Story Book Dining. Our table is ready. How cool. Well, nothing like when you get into the restaurant, you realize you've been mispronouncing it the wrong way the whole time. But here's a little bit of the uh, I don't know, what would you call this? The rook? The whatever the room off. I don't know. I'm not sure what you call this. So in the spirit of good culture, I'm just gonna say totally not the way this restaurant is pronounced the way I just did the intro. Totally not. But we're not gonna do it because we're not gonna murder the Norwegian <laughs> language, so nevertheless, we're here. All right, dude, what'd you think of the bread? I was very impressed. That was amazing. Uh, the cinnamon butter, when I made the butter, I mean, it made yeah. amazing. 
Do you eat that all day, huh? Mm-hmm. All right, let's get Mama's reaction. All right, Mama. I'm with Keegan. That was delicious. And they they told us we could order as much of anything as we want. So we might, we might have to ask for some more of that. It's so good. All right, Breeze, what did you think? That was so good. I want more. You want more? Yes. She wants more. No, that was fantastic. That that cinnamon butter was awesome. Love it. We, we will definitely get excited to that. All right, my dears, what do we think about the salad? So the salad is very good. The dressing, the vinaigrette, ling- lingonberry, I think is what she said it was. Very um, flavorful. And the salad itself is nice and fresh. So, so far, we're off to a great start. This it's week. a hit at however it's you pronounce hit. that name. No, no, ra- no dragons today. No, no. Do you have your prince protector though? That's right. Yes. Maybe you want to get him a sort of tooth and a shilling or two as well. <laughs> you want that, bud? Yes, Can we all join together for a moment? Can you take a picture of me and Sissy? <laughs> Girls would like to take a picture with you, please. Wonderful. <laughs> Hi. 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 Good smiles, guys. Awesome. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Hello. I'm Snow White. I'm so happy to see you. Yes, very much so. Yes. Yes. All right, my dearest, what do you think? So we have had our fill. I think we're still kind of working on the main course, but um, the meatballs were a huge hit. Everybody loved the meatballs, the mashed potatoes, the mac and cheese. The cabbage is very tasty. Um, Brielle's our seafood eater. She tried the salmon. I don't think she cared for it too much. Oh, can't forget the chicken and dumplings. Those were really good too. So I've been impressed with this meal so far. What about you? Well, there's the damage. <laughs> and this was... Actually, the first plate out, pretty much all gone. And then we added a little more chicken and dumplings, or sorry, meatballs and uh, mac and cheese. So yeah, I think this is another surprisingly very good meal here. I agree, um, the ch- chicken and dumplings were fantastic. The meatball, absolutely good, awesome. And the mac and cheese actually was good too. I can't wait for the dessert. Princesses were good, in and out, done. I like the family style. You know, that's one thing about the family style stuff. They, you don't have to worry about missing the princess or missing the cow. Oh, we got another one. Oh my gosh. I forgot. We got five. This is a bonus. Holy cow. Aurora just came. We don't have a bunch of seed. Wait, lots of seaweed under the sea. Do you eat seaweed too? No. no. You can have some on your mashed potatoes, just a little sprinkling on top. Oh. It makes it very salty and crunchy. It's delicious. That might be an added touch. I'm not sissy. <laughs> Seaweed. <laughs> Seaweed. Hey, awesome. thank you, Ariel. Thank you, Ariel. All right, so I kind of got lost there because Ariel popped in here. Anyway, good meal. I enjoyed it. I agree with uh, my dearest. I enjoyed it. Can't wait for the dessert. All right, dude. What do you think? Worthy of a 13-year-old? Mm-hmm. Uh, for me, the favorites were meatballs and mac and cheese because I'm not adventurous. Um, and then the der- desserts were both amazing. Uh, I think I think the log thing was a mousse, but the other one was like whipped cream. Good stuff, huh? Mm-hmm. All right, Mother Dearest. Yes. First experience. First experience. I'm sort of sad that it took us so long to get here. I would have loved to have done this when Bria was a lot littler. 
um, but I'm glad we got to do it, and I'm so happy that it's reopened. I know it's something that a lot of people have been waiting for. The whole uh, dining experience was great. Wonderful service. The food was fantastic. We got to see five princesses. I mean, that's unbelievable in and of itself. So this is definitely a two thumbs up um, dining experience. All right, Breeze, what did you think about the meal? It was really good. Delicious, wonderful. What was your favorite? Um, meatballs. And you like the cabbage, too? Yeah. Okay, how about the dessert? It was good. And what was your favorite? Oh, the dessert? Yeah. I don't know. All of it? Yeah. All right. And I would agree with everything my uh, lovely wife said. So just another dining experience, character dining experience here in uh, Epcot. Uh, Garden Grill being the other one, definitely worth it. I'm surprised we haven't. As many times we've been back to Disney, I'm really surprised we've not been to this uh, experience. But that basically does it for all of them, with the exception of one yet not yet opened up at uh, the Grand Floridian. That said, please like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Onward to our next adventure.